get it together. Hey everyone, I'm Hannah. <laughs> um, I post about being a doula and a birth worker and what my journey has been like and this is gonna be a totally different video because I found out a couple weeks ago that I'm pregnant. And it's so exciting and I'm so happy. And you'd never be able to know by looking at me. But um, I've been binging a bunch of videos on YouTube about um, people's pregnancy progression and how they're feeling and updates just to like compare because I'm kind of neurotic about everything and everyone looks perfect and beautiful <laughs> and I honestly have not put makeup on since I found out I was pregnant about two and a half week weeks ago and um, this is real life this is what I look like because I'm constantly trying not to vomit so this is as good as it's gonna get I want to make a real video about what the first trimester is like I feel like shit. I cried a lot last night and then I cried again this morning. And I wanted to be honest about the fact that it's like 2 p.m. and I have been laying in bed all day. Um, because I feel sick. I feel like the closest I can describe it to is I feel extremely hungover. So anyway, so I've been surrounded by birth and pregnancy um, and postpartum for the last year and a half. And I thought I knew everything there was to know about this journey and I'm realizing, the first thing I realized is I have no idea what the first trimester looks like. I wanted to be this like floating goddess of a pregnant woman and uh, I'm not at all. So I'm making this video for all the women out there who <laughs> feel like shit but are also really excited to be pregnant um, but are also really scared. I'm gonna cry. I cry all the time. I don't think that I've wanted anything as much as I've wanted to carry a child. And now it's here. And it is the most frightening thing I've ever done in my entire life. So I guess we'll start from the beginning. <laughs> this was a planned pregnancy. Um, my husband and I could not be any more excited to be able to plan for this baby's arrival. But it's just not as easy as peeing on a stick and seeing that you're pregnant and waiting nine months and then having a baby in your arms. It's so much more than that. So I believe I'm about six weeks and four days from the date that we believe we conceived. I've only known I was pregnant for just a little over two weeks and I've noticed so many quick physical changes um, and it's insane like when I first found out I was pregnant I was like oh that explains why I've been peeing so much and what else was it that explains why my boobs were so sore and that's so funny and I can't wait to see what else changes and and I was like a week after I found out you know I can't eat without <laughs> running to the bathroom and sticking my head in the toilet that is one of the symptoms I've wanted. I want to be sick, I want to feel pregnant, I want to know that things are going well, but just because something is good, just because I'm having these symptoms, and just because I had them early, doesn't mean that they're not difficult. You know, it can be a blessing, and it can also, at the same time, be such a big challenge. Like, your body is uncomfortable. <laughs> And you don't have an appetite, but at the same time you're starving. <laughs> and this all seems like really petty, small issues to deal with, but when you deal with it from the moment you wake up in the morning until you fall asleep, if you can even fall asleep, it just starts to like really, <sighs> it can mess with your head. I'm just terrified all the time. I'm only six weeks. Um, anything can happen and I think not getting close to a pregnancy too early on is a defense mechanism 
if I don't get close to this pregnancy and something were to go wrong, I might not feel a shitty. Although I don't know if that's the case. But that's what my brain is telling me. And I feel like I'm supposed to have more shit in order and I don't. Am I happy? Yes. Am I terrified? Yes. Am I anxious? Yes. And that's okay. Do I want to eat kale chips? Fuck no. Regardless, I think it's good. I think this is just like a kick in the ass to get, to get me to where I've always wanted to be. This experience has just shed a lot of light on some things that I do that aren't healthy for my mental state. So anyway, hi, I'm pregnant. 